The North Bay wildfires destroyed 8,900 structures, 3,000 in Santa Rosa alone. One of them belonged to this man. ABC 7 News reporter Dion Lim found him dazed, wandering the streets after his home was leveled. They return one month later to see what's left. Our bedroom and then the kids' bedrooms was here and here. Neil Blodgett, his wife and three daughters, had lived in this Santa Rosa home for 14 years until the knock on the door. And then the sheriff's like, you got three minutes to get out. It was 1230 in the morning and in a foggy right haze there, without look. thinking. Just traumatized. I mean, I got nothing. I should have been able to grab something. Neil ran out the door with just the clothes on his back. This is all I'm wearing. It's all I got. That's how we met, dazed and covered in ash. It looks like a war zone. Across the street, the burned down Hilton Sonoma wine country, a spot Neil is seeing for the first fire. time. It's been that deep. This 2200 degrees or more to do that. Next to it, a restaurant which held special significance also right turned to rubble. This was the place that I took my future wife, my future wife to her first date. And when, since we've been married for 30 years. Back at their house, one of the 1800 structures that burned down in Santa Rosa, nothing can be saved. This is a log splitter that I used and it's just you can't, I can't believe it. Evidence of the man who used to live here is everywhere. An auto body specialist who lovingly restored more than a dozen cars. Um, I had already done all the body work and paint on the front end. All turned to dark skeletons good. of his former life. Sure is hard to let it go. It's a beautiful car. Neil still works with his hands, but has since found himself a job as a builder. But for now, he just wants one thing. More time with the family. I think this has brought our family closer together. And maybe one day, a new car. In Santa Rosa, Dion Lim, ABC 7 News.